Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Can you hear me? Yes. Oh, yeah. I can hear you. Okay. I can hear you. I can hear the Tea Parties of America saying something's wrong with our government and it's broken. You know, God is not in it. They're trying to teach liberal principles to our kids. They want socialism in America. Now, are you going to let it happen? No. It's time for us to take it back, and that's why we gather here today to fight. Yes. We call this Ames Tea Party. My family is from Massachusetts, originally on my mom's side. I go back there quite often. We built a, a shovel company, uh, governor of Massachusetts, governor of Mississippi, and Fisher Ames, he said something, was, you probably don't know who he is, but Fisher Ames, he said, the Bible is the best book of its time. It's the best history book. It's the best English book. It makes us all the same. And he said that for a reason. And Fisher Ames was the author of the First Amendment to the Constitution. That's my ancestor. I hope I have one drop from him that I might make a change to this country. And he recognized, he recognized, as did George Washington, he gave the eulogy for George Washington. He went to Harvard at 12, graduated from Harvard at 16. He gave the eulogy for George Washington. And these men in the foundation and building of this country recognized that we need God in order to make it work because we are, in, we are a corrupt people. And it's only through the grace of Jesus Christ that we can be saved. Amen. And because of that, we must ask for his help and, his, and pray to him, to, begging him for our help to help us put this together. We are, as Tom DeLay says, you know, we're separatists. The Democrats are collectivists. So I gather you here today to try to unify you in a collective force to take our country back. Anyway, thank you for coming. Thank you for serving our country. You are our soldiers. <clears throat> it's August the 4th, according to a document I have here. And the document says that Obama was born in Hawaii on August the 4th. And I think you all have a document. You can go get one of those. He says he's born here on August the 4th. The trouble is, I served in the Navy in 1962, and it says African. In 1962, we didn't call anybody African. But we should send him, sing him happy birthday anyway. What do you think? No. 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 <laughs> well, you're correct. Because I have another document that says he's born here, <coughs> born on the... Uh, 5th of August, and uh, two days later gets a certificate of birth registration. And so, and then we have, uh, so the real, anyway, at the bottom line, pick up one of those documents, you'll find it quite interesting. I am a birther. Anybody else here birthers? <laughs> we have to vet this guy. Anyway, thank you for being here. Uh, let's begin a moment of prayer. And uh, dear Lord, we ask you to bless our soldiers, these people here today. Take a hold of them and make, make them, help them, and bless them to take our country back. We praise you and give you thanks in Jesus' name. Amen.